Hello everyone, welcome to Efficient User. In today's video, we are going to discuss about uh, the scroll to top or scroll to bottom options available in Angular. So we are going to create a element which is going to have a lots of text and we are going to create a scroll bar uh, uh, on top of that uh, content uh, manually. After that, we are going to implement scroll to top and a scroll to bottom uh, functions. So let's get started. For that, I'm going to create an Angular project with uh, the boilerplate code we have. So we have the code on place. So this is the uh, basic code we have. Here I'm going to create a div uh, class name scroll element inside this uh, we are going to display a few uh, text uh, let's create a list from that we are go uh, we can iterate and uh, display the text here we'll just uh, create something and we can add some dynamic function to add a uh, content dynamically for that uh, i'm going to get some text basically lower 100 I'm just using the uh, amount of uh, amount option to generate some dynamic text here so i placed it here so now we are going to iterate that particular list and display that here Oops. list So we just displayed a few text. I'm going to uh, provide some CSS option to display scroll bar for this particular uh, content. So here uh, I'm going to set height as some 200 pixel. And if it overflows 200%, just display me a scroll bar. Okay, we just got it. We got some scroll bar, nice scroll bar here. As a next thing, I'm going to create two buttons to scroll to top or scroll to bottom. I'm going to create a button. Let's name it as scroll to top. And we'll just copy paste. And I rename it as scroll to bottom. Okay, uh, let's add some function for it. Scroll top. It's like uh, when this particular button has been clicked, it should scroll the content to the top of the div. And name it as scroll bottom. It's just showing up the error in the right hand side because. Uh, we don't have uh, that function in the TypeScript, so I'm just going to create it. Make samples. So I just created a function for scroll top. And we need a scroll bottom. Still like uh, we set up our two buttons and. Uh, created a uh, similar uh, functions here so how we can achieve like a uh, programmatically scroll to the bottom so for that what we are going to do is like uh, we are going to get the height of this particular div and we are just going to scroll it a little bit uh, dynamically using program for that I am going back to my HTML okay uh, we can just uh, show in a full screen in the HTML, I'm going to declare a ID for this div, which is having this scroll bar. So let's say I'm typing hash and typing some certified name scroll. And inside my uh, TypeScript, I'm going to get the, the value. View child. Here, I'm mentioning the ID of the div. And a local variable is I'm just putting the same name just to have 
easy reference and I'm going to mention the type as element reference so it will provide HTML element related contents with respect to the ID I have provided so this has been uh, imported from Anglo slash core element ref and view child now go back to our uh, scroll to top function first what I'm going to do is like I'm going to call this this dot scroll basically it will have information of this particular div and then once I press the uh, uh, dot here uh, it's showing like a native element so basically it will have the HTML later information like a few things you can see it and I'm going to type as scroll top. so I'm going to say whenever scroll to top has been clicked set it as zero which means this the current view we are seeing is like a scroll top zero so I'm just uh, scrolling down and clicking scroll to top you could see so it has been moved to top uh, whenever we clicked uh, scroll to top button so if you click now it, it won't make any change because it's already having the same uh, unit so I'm scrolling a little bit and clicking scroll to top now yeah it's working okay scroll to top is looks easy so because we set it as a zero it's showing in the first place how we can get the end point like a scroll to bottom yeah we have an option here I'm just uh, selecting the same scroll again now native element dot scroll to top I'm just going to use the same operation but instead of setting the zero I'm going to set the maximum height of the div to get that I'm using the same option here is the scroll dot native element dot instead of scroll top I'm going to get scroll height let's see whether it works if I click scroll to bottom yeah it's just working as expected so basically what it is going to provide me is like a going to get me the height of that particular uh, div so to show that I'm going to write that in console you can copy this and put it there Oops. we could see whenever we click uh, scroll to bottom this will show the information in console okay so let's clear the existing messages I'm just going to click scroll to bottom so we could see like uh, the actual height of the particular div is 29 so how about adding the content dynamically and clicking the scroll to bottom for that I'm going to create another button say add content operation add content going back to my TypeScript I'm going to paste this since we already provided this content as a list I'm going to push some text inside it it's dot list dot push name put some text here for time being I'm just copying the same text So you know the, the add content button has been clicked what it will be doing is like it will append the text at the end so let me scroll a little bit so now it's not in a scroll to top or scroll to bottom it's just in the intermediate thing and just clicking add content so you could see the uh, changes happened here some content has been added at the end and the scroll bar has been updated the current portion remains same at the end the text has been added so scroll bar is getting shrinked so if you click scroll to bottom now we could see the height is 1145 because the div size has been increased because of the large text and we have updated the information here so if you click scroll to top now it works so this is how uh, we can do it or like even if you want to like uh, move the scroll to some particular uh, thing we can try it for example instead of uh, setting the scroll light uh, if I set 500 
and adding some content now if I click scroll to bottom it should go to the position uh, height of 500 so I'm just reverting it you can remove this console.log so that's it so we could be able to scroll to bottom scroll to top add some content and scroll to bottom now and scroll to top this way we could be able to achieve uh, scroll to bottom or scroll to uh, top in angular with the help of view child and uh, element ref and uh, getting the height of that particular div thank you so much for watching please do support and subscribe the channel make sure you comment uh, your feedbacks in the comment section below thank you so much